Before you begin installation, review the included instructions and verify that you have all the required parts, tools, and hardware before proceeding. For more helpful tips, visit roughcountry.com forward slash before you lift. To begin installation, remove your wheels and tires. Remove the brake line from the strut and retain the stock hardware. Remove the ABS line from the knuckle. Remove the sway bar from the strut. Remove the lower strut bolts. Remove the upper strut nuts. Remove the strut from the vehicle. Install the supplied studs in the spacer using the supplied nut to pull the studs through the holes in the spacer. Compress the strut using the strut compressor and remove the upper nut. Install the coil spring spacer with the factory retaining bushing. Reinstall the upper strut retainer with the factory hardware. Install the strut spacer on the strut and tighten. Reinstall the strut assembly in the upper strut mount. Install the supplied camber bolt in the upper location and the stock hardware in the lower hole. Tighten the upper strut hardware. Install the supplied sway bar link relocation bracket. Install the factory sway bar link in the bracket with the factory nut. Reinstall the brake line on the knuckle using the factory hardware and tighten. Reinstall the ABS wire on the knuckle in the factory location. Moving to the rear of the vehicle, remove the brace from both passenger and driver side. Remove the sway bar link and retain the bushings, cup washers, and lower nut for reuse. Support the lower control arm with a floor jack under the outer mount of the control arm. Remove the outer arm hardware and retain the stock hardware for reuse. Remove the inner control arm hardware and lower the arm assembly using the floor jack. Remove the strut hardware from the lower arm and remove the arm. Assemble the bushings and sleeves in the lower inner arm and connect the lower outer arm with the supplied cam bolts and washers. Do not tighten at this time. Install the new lower arm assembly on the strut. Insert the outer assembly in the hub then secure with the factory hardware and tighten. Using a floor jack on the arm hub assembly and the inner arm at the same time, jack up the arm into position. Align holes using a pry bar and install the factory hardware. Install the factory bushings and cup washers. Reinstall the brace that was removed earlier on the side you have completed and tighten. Now reinstall the wheels and tires. Lower the vehicle onto the ground and tighten the inner arm bolts and strut bolts. After installing any suspension component, it is advised that you have a qualified alignment center. Give your vehicle a proper alignment immediately.